Lin, a ten-year-old girl from South China's Fujian province, was born with situs inversus totalis, a congenital condition in which all of the body's internal organs are situated on the opposite side of the body. This is a CT image of the girl's body. This is the right side, and this is the left. This is her liver. Normally, the liver is on the right side, but in her case, its position is reversed. Her stomach is also this way. Actually, all of her organs, including her heart, are inverted. Wang said some people with this condition can still lead normal, healthy lives. However, Lin also has to contend with cyanotic congenital heart defect, or CHD, a disease that can cause infants to suffer from a lack of oxygen. The disease is rare, striking just 10 out of every 10,000 infants. Lin was born with blue lips and toes due to the disease. Without surgical treatment, infants with this heart disease may not live to reach adolescence. Problems can arise if such infants start crying hard, as they have malfunctioning hearts, can cause a lack of oxygen that can be fatal. In Lin's case, her heart also suffers from six types of severe deformities. Situs inversus and CHD have made her treatment all the more difficult. She received an operation when she was two years old. But another operation was needed in order to raise her blood oxygen saturation to a normal level. However, her family was not able to afford the surgery when it was most needed. It was only recently that they were able to raise enough money for the operation. We encountered two major difficulties during the operation. First, because of it had been so long since her first operation, her heart had more time to fuse itself to the tissue surrounding it, which forced us to take more time to separate the heart. We also had to change some of our standard operating procedures due to the deformities in her cardiac structure and inverted heart position. Luckily, Lin's operation went well. She recovered fully with no complications, and her blood oxygen saturation level has reached a normal level. It is believed that Lin will be able to lead a healthy life after leaving the hospital.